Augustina is better. If you see my cat jump up or the heater go on, that is because that's just the reality of my life. If you think about skincare and the complete different ranges from $20 to $100 to $300. Once upon a time, skincare was only pretty much La Mer, where $300 a jar was looked upon as taboo and only in the realm of celebrities. But now you see all of these other companies and they too have really high price points. And the question is, is it worth it? Especially because with companies like this, Augustine is Batter, it's been around for 26 months and it's won 26 awards. So why is it getting all the hype? This is a website by Amy Lawrenson. What's the deal with Augustinus Batter skincare? The formula contains trigger factor complex, TFC8 for short. This proprietary technology is at the core of every product and is a result of 30 years of clinical research. Rather than leaning on just one hero ingredient, TFC8 comprises more than 40 different ingredients, including medical grade vitamins, lipids, proteins, and amino acids, which in very precise quantities and combination helps the skin to repair itself. TFC8 is essentially a toolbox providing the skin with everything it needs to fix the things that go wrong, whether that's age-related or from things like pollution. When you are able to do that, you can support epigenetic factors that enable the skin to rejuvenate your skin according to your own needs, says Batter. This is the rich cream. The difference between the two marketing wise is that one is for the daytime and one is for the nighttime the rich cream which is supposed to be for the nighttime is all i've tried and i find that it works perfectly well in the morning time i understand why they say that the cream is more of an am cream because the ingredients are a little bit different they include vitamin c and a and d and E, but they're really on the bottom of the list. I don't think they're doing a whole lot in regards to that. With the rich cream, it's completely nourishing the skin and you feel it getting nourished very quickly. I don't really feel the need for the cream at all, but I do feel the need to add a vitamin C or a retinol, depending on whether it's the day or night, with the rich cream. That's just my opinion. I'm also not in my 20s, so maybe the rich cream might be a bit thick for those in the 20s, but I don't even find it very thick. The consistency... is kind of your normal... I don't want to waste very much at all it's kind of your normal lotion cream it just absorbs quicker it's never something that you will feel lingering on the surface of your skin which is something i appreciate if i want to layer on an oil afterwards which is just something i do because i'm extra not because i necessarily need to at this point technically it should last me two weeks according to their website costs 85 dollars twice the size is 170 dollars and then 50 milliliters is at 265 dollars now it's really about whether you want to spend 170 dollars for your lotion every single month i will say that with this cream you do not need to layer much i've had this for longer than two weeks i've been using this sometimes morning and night and i still see that there's some in here so i don't think that's accurate and i'm not under using this i'm using this just the right amount which is one two three four pumps i've heard that this pills but i haven't experienced it myself my layering is not extreme so that may also be the reason for that do i think that it's worth it 170 dollars a month for a cream is very expensive but if you are all about saving time because i've also come to realize on nights when i'm very very tired this is very handy when all i want to do is wash my face put on my retinol quickly and then pop this on 
done versus layering other things. It just, for whatever reason, it alleviates any stress that I have about continuing the rest of my night when I'm extremely tired. Their exfoliators also at about $90, so everything's not $300 from the company, which is good to know. Their cleansing balm is $70. Their cleansing gel is $65. And the exfoliating toner is at $85. The price of the cream and the rich cream are exactly the same, and they come in the exact same sizes. They do have a collaboration with Victoria Beckham to sell rejuvenating priming moisturizer. I have been wondering about this product for a while. I understand why there is such a hype. To be honest with you, my expectations have not been surpassed, but they have been met, and that is good enough for me. It would go in my top five. It's not something that will blow your mind, but you will notice that your skin drinks this up. The glow is immediate. I'm a huge fan. They're coming out with a bunch of other products, and I assume they work just as well as this. And if I'm lucky enough, I will get to try it one day. I got this in my Net-A-Porte advent box. It's really the best in terms of deals. I've also seen this in the Cult Beauty and Space NK advent, although I'm not positive about that. And I'm also not positive if it's the rich cream or just the cream. I'm very happy that the rich cream is the one that I ended up with. So I hope this helps. I will keep the reviews coming. See you soon.